hello guys welcome and welcome back to Rika's kitchen today I'm going to show you how to make a tasty and simple beef liver if you haven't subscribed to my channel please please kindly do so you don't get to miss any of my videos each and every week then stay tuned to enjoy my recipe on today's ingredients you're going to need one slice of onion ginger garlic and green bell pepper pests a half a kg of beef liver I've soaked it in some milk, 3 to 4 tablespoons of oil, a half a teaspoon of black paper, 1 teaspoon of beef masala, 1 teaspoon of curry powder, and some salt to test. In a pan or a pot, you're going to add 3 to 4 tablespoons of oil and let the oil to heat up. Once the oil is hot, you're going to add the sliced onion and cook the onion till golden brown. Once your onion starts turning color, you're going to add your soft beef liver. Like I said, I soaked the liver in some milk. Adding some milk in the liver, it adds an extra amazing taste to the liver. Then add the ginger, garlic and green bell pepper pests and mix everything well and let the liver to cook on a low medium heat. Then you're going to add a half a teaspoon of salt, one teaspoon of curry powder, one teaspoon of beef masala, a half a teaspoon of black paper and mix everything well and let the liver to continue to cook. Let the liver to cook on a low medium heat for approximately 5 to 7 minutes till your liver is well cooked. So make sure you don't overcook a liver because it tends to lose the taste. Once the liver is well cooked like this, then your liver is ready and remove it from the fire. And my beef liver is ready as you can see in the video and serve on a plate or a bowl. Lastly, I'm going to garnish my beef liver with some dried petasili or you can use some dried coriander, optional if you don't like. And my beef liver stir fry is ready as you can see in the video. It's nicely cooked and it's so, so tasty. You can eat along with some rice, ugali, chapati or anything that you like and enjoy your beef liver. Thank you for watching my video and hope you loved it and if you want to see other recipes I'll put the links in the description box and if you have any questions you can comment down below or you can follow me on my social media Facebook and Instagram Rukia's Kitchen for further questions and thank you once again bye bye